trophies downstairs, but then we got a new Koopa plush. He looks almost exactly like Parachupa, which is a little weird. I mean, even their size is so similar. I mean, look at these two. I mean, even their, both their heads even are um, at like some odd angles for some reason. But, uh, well, this guy's a red shell on wings and the you know, keychain up on the top. This guy is a green shell, no wings and no keychain. But it's not about parachute, but it's about Koopa. So let's get to the other one. And, here you go, Koopa. He's a really soft plush. Very comfortable feel to him. A little small, but like the whole series, the whole series is like kind of small. Except a uh, few like Bowser and Warner and Waluigi. But uh, there's Ted. Let's get the angle. Super Mario. Right, and let's open that up. And a bunch of Japanese stuff, website, blah blah blah. It's like pretty, the same thing as the Humble Saw by other Mario plushes. We got it off Amazon for $14. Yeah, I believe it's a Nintendo World for like 10 but we were only there once. Uh, but we did not get in there. We were kind of a short budget, but... Uh, we, uh, He's really soft, a uh, pretty good size comparison to uh, most of the other characters. You saw what it looked like. Um, Paratrooper. Here, here's a uh, comparison to Goomba. You may think that Goomba looks a little big in comparison to him, but uh, keep in mind that he is sitting. So maybe if you like to uh, get him in the standing position, he'll look a little better. Um, but, uh, Oh well, I rate this guy like a 10 out of 10 everything except size, but then again I'd probably do it for almost all of the guys in this set. They're a little small, but well, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. We want more subscribers. Uh, and uh, yeah, so this is the Plush Bros saying goodbye. Give me thumbs. Hey, that's my line. Ugh. Huh. Loser. Uh huh. Uh huh. Donkey Kong's the winner. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh yeah.